Hello Outre, I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with the palette bingo with the Whale Sun palette from Nori Cosmetics and yes, I want to use this palette like all the time because I have waited for this for so long. So I am doing a palette bingo and I am going to pick five shades. The palette look like this. So five shades with random.org. So I am just going to it's 12 shades and I guess I will do this because I can't film my screen so I will zoom in and hopefully you can see this so we will generate a hey, mister okay does this ever do okay now it's generating number four six one twelve one four six twelve and six again one again twelve again ten so one I'm going to swatch them okay so these are the shades that I got so it's one four six 10 and 12. I hope it's correct. So it isn't all the colors that I've tried before so that is good. So in the palette it is, we have like color everywhere. It's pearl, cetacean, I have no idea how to pronounce that, reef, dive and whale song so i'm going to figure out what i'm going to do but it feels like a pretty easy color scheme so i'm going to think a little bit think away this and then we just get started okay so i think i have decided i will start with this light blue and take it in my crease i can't remember if i used this in my first impression but I'm pretty sure that I didn't. I am also thinking about doing a palette bingo with... I don't know if I should take all the three palettes. Both Dragon Child, Whale Song and Feral palette. Because the Dragon Child isn't available as a palette anymore. You can buy all the shades but it's not available as a palette. Because I want to do a palette bingo, a multi palette bingo. <laughs> so do you want me to use all three palettes or maybe just the Feral palette and the Whale Song palette? Please let me know because I think that maybe will be the next palette bingo I am doing. I really like this. This is kinda... I feel that some colors can be really some lighter colors can be really like they're not so pastely pastel. pastel colors are usually not blendable like this but i think this keeps its color even though i blend it out i have to build it up but i can use my normal technique for this so that is good. Okay, and I am going to do a halo eye today, but I don't really know which colors. I want this like in my halo, but I don't know if I will take these two or this green and this one. I think the green should would look cool together with the whale song, but I don't know. Okay, now I have to swap. And if I can't decide which one I want to use, I always swatch them. I always swatch them like this on my hand and I can see how they look together. Okay, I think I will take the green and the shimmer blue together with Halo because it feels like these are too, too similar. So it would not be such a fun look. So I think I will take the green. I will take the green. 
And these shadows, they stain my fingers, they stain like crazy. I can get it off my hand, I hope. So, okay, I go in with the green one, reef and put it... I want the blue shimmer in the middle of my halo. So I'm taking this reef out here. And also in here, and I am trying to do a pretty small halo. Okay, and now I fucked that up. Darn. Okay, maybe this is going to be a pretty small halo. I just go in with the brush that I took in my crease. Just to blend this a little bit together up here. Okay, so maybe this is good. I am so sure what I am doing. Just going to smudge it a little bit. And I will do the same on the other eye because I want them to be pretty similar in size. My halo. Okay, I think something like this and I think I will take a glitter glue to the whale song shade because it feels it's not dry but I think it will look better if I take a glitter glue and then I can also I'm just taking this glitter glue and now like my fingers and my hand is so stained and I like never cut my either cut crease or halo with a concealer anymore because I like this so much more it's easier to get a nice blend with this so yeah okay and then we're going with the whale song shade and I really hope that this will stuck to my brush Us and then we put it on. Okay, this is like a lot darker than the green. And I don't like care if you have like the halo is darker. Even maybe if it I think it's not supposed to be that, but um, if you haven't noticed this yet, I don't give. A, I don't care what you should and should not do when it comes to makeup. Okay, so I will go in with a reef again, the green one, and try to blend them in a little bit better together. So I'm just going over the edge and being concentrated on what I'm doing and my halo just shrank and I'm going in with whale song again and intensify it a little bit and blend it and this whale song shade is amazing what do I think about this? I think it would have been so cool if I have taken only the blues but and then the green on my lower lash but I think that was like the expected thing to do so maybe I like this better and I just take my crease color once again and run this over and I want a little bit more of the green which that one out here and I actually think that I'm satisfied with this little halo here so yeah I will do the same thing on the other eye fix my base and my brows and then I will be back and we 
have two shades left. We have this one and this one. So, pearl and dive. Yeah, dive. <laughs> Good. So, I will fix the other eye dressed and then I will come back and we will see what we do with the last two colors. Okay, so for my under eyes then, I will start with the right brush and I will start with dive and take it. I will have this pearl as my inner corner and down there, of course. So I will take dive on the rest of my lower lash. And I have no idea how this is. Something like that and then I will take pearl and put it in here and I will spray this because I don't want this to fall. And this is not like the whale song. This is more like a mousse or like cream. It is like in a dragon child. I think it's Firefly in the Dragon Child that is very moussey and this pearl was the same. This whale song was harder in consistency, so just so you know. So I will put this in my inner corner and also down here. And I got too much. This brush is so like flimsy. I don't know why I keep on using it. I like it, but it's, it's a little bit hard to control. I have so much of this, but I just have to go with the flow here. So, okay, that was all the shadows for my waterline. I think I will take a teaspoon to match the lid. I will put on mascara and something on my lips. I I think I maybe know what I want to do, but maybe not. So I will just fix this, I will come back and then we fix, we see the complete finished look. So for my lips I took the Ultra Satin in November from Colourpop. This was not what I had in mind, I was thinking about taking something darker, but then I was like, I like always take dark lips. So yeah. This was my palette bingo with a whale song palette and I like this look. I don't think it's something like super unique that you can only do with this palette but it is a palette bingo and I can't do so much about it because I have to use the shades I got in the palette bingo. So yeah, I have used pearl and this one, what the now the name is, reef, dive and whale song and I like this look, it was easy to work with them. This pearl is like a moussey um, fluke and whale song and I think splash as well are not the same. I can't talk about splash because I haven't used it. But pearl is very very creamy, it works. If you don't spray it I think you will get a ton of fallout and it maybe would not have it sticked if I didn't spray it because I don't have any eyeshadow primer but other than that I like this look I love to play with this palette so it's going to be so fun to do more with it so yeah I really hope you like this look and do you want me to do a pal multi palette bingo with all the palettes from Menagerie or only this and the Faro palette please let me know and I will fix that and I think that will be my next palette bingo I'm not sure, <laughs> I think. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!